Welcome to 2024, tech enthusiasts. It's a new year in Silicon Valley, and while the tech giants are still the cool kids on the block, they're reshuffling the deck a bit. Stick around to find out ultimately if AI is creating more jobs in the future or downsizing the workforce as mundane tasks do not need manpower behind them. Coming up next on this episode of AI Renaissance. AI is the name and changing the game's the aim. Companies are diving headfirst into the AI pool and it's making quite the splash. Not all layoffs are AI's autograph. Sure, there's been chatter about AI taking over jobs, but let's not blame everything on the new kid. Just as they're pumping cash into AI, tech firms are also taking a hard look at their teams. From Discord shedding 17% of its crew to Unity Software saying see ya to a quarter of its team, the cuts are real. More than 5,500 tech jobs have vanished faster than New Year's resolutions, and it's just the start of 2024. As for AI, it's like the unpredictable weather of the tech world. Some say it's sunny days ahead with new job creations, while others pack an umbrella for the potential job losses. With all these changes, some folks are raising eyebrows about who's getting the short end of the stick. For instance, Chegg, an education technology company, recently announced a 4% reduction in its workforce, which equates to around 80 employees. The reason behind this move was to realign the company with its AI strategy and create sustainable value for its students and investors. IBM CEO Arvind Krishna raised eyebrows in May when he mentioned that the company was considering halting hiring for roles that could potentially be replaced by AI in the near future. However, he later clarified that his earlier comments were taken out of context and emphasized that AI is going to create more jobs than it takes away. Another example comes from Dropbox, a file storage service which disclosed in late April that it would be letting go of approximately 16% of its workforce, roughly 500 people with AI cited as one of the reasons for this decision. In a recent layoffs report, outplacement firm Challenger Gray and Christmas revealed that in May 3,900 individuals were laid off due to AI-related factors. Significantly, all of these job cuts occurred within the tech sector. While these developments might raise concerns about the potential job displacement caused by AI, they also provide insights into how businesses are adapting to this evolving technology. Instead of rendering entire skill sets obsolete overnight, as some might fear, the immediate impact of AI tools seems to be compelling companies to reallocate resources to better harness AI's capabilities. This shift is placing a premium on workers with expertise in AI. Drew Houston, CEO of Dropbox, acknowledged this shift by stating, Over the last few months, AI has captured the world's collective imagination, expanding the potential market for our next generation of AI-powered products more rapidly than any of us could have anticipated. Our next stage of growth requires a different mix of skill sets, particularly in AI and early-stage product development. The company is actively hiring for multiple roles focused on new AI initiatives. According to Dan Wang, a professor at Columbia Business School, AI will lead organizations to restructure, but the widespread replacement of humans by machines is not an imminent scenario. AI's influence on the job market is more about reshaping roles and skills rather than complete job displacement.